Okay, welcome to another episode of This Is Anything Goes and today we are going to be working on the bicycle and we are going to be install a uh, Decathlon BC500 uh, bike computer, alright? So, let's get to it. Okay, so first let's unbox. Okay, so what we have is uh, three different sizes of rubber rings. Instruction manual, the computer itself, and the sensor, transmitter, whatever you call this. Alright, so, oh, okay, it comes with a rubber pad as well. Okay, so just twist it. Okay. Okay, fairly simple, just a couple of things, alright, so let's get to the installation part. Okay, so now that the installation is done, let's go through the menu, alright? The first thing uh, you notice when you turn it on, okay, so how do we turn it on, alright? There's, there's basically three buttons on this uh, unit, alright? Left, right, and the top button here. Okay, so to turn it on, you hold the top button. Okay, so when you first start it up, you ask you to set the time. I've already done that, so we'll miss that part. Okay, so let's see what menu we have, alright? We have the speed, the current speed, and the um, current uh, kilometers that you are going at. As in, how much you have done. Alright, then we have the time. Then we have the average speed. We have the maximum speed. We have the time. We have the temperature. Total kilometers. Okay, then we have the settings, alright? So let's go into the settings and see what we can see, alright? First off, you notice that the bar on the bottom here has a spanner, alright? So if we were to click on OK on the top here, we will be able to set the time, alright? So whether 24 or 12 hour um, format, then you get to set the time, okay? So it's 9.55 over here at my side. Press one more time on OK to set the minute, and then it's done. Alright, the next setting that we can do is to set the tire size. Alright, so let's go into it. So the diameter of the uh, tires. Alright, we have 14, 16, 20, 24, 26, 27.5, 28, 
twenty nine six fifty seven hundred. All right, so we are seven hundred. Then the tire width. All right, so we have. 23, 25, 28, 32, 35, 38, 40, 42, 45. We are in mountain bike range already. Alright, so mine is at 25, so that's what I'm going to set. And then I'm going to click on OK. Okay. Units, alright, units. So we can set it to either meters or miles. Okay, so it's in Malaysia, but I'm in Malaysia, so we are going to go with kilometers. Okay, temperature, Celsius or Fahrenheit. Again, in Malaysia, we are going by Celsius. Okay, this is to pair to the unit. You do not, you don't, you do not need to do this unless you are changing the sensor. All right. Okay, this is to do a master reset, and that's it. All right, that's it. So this is the end of the video. And as usual, I will leave a link down in the description on where to purchase this. This cost me about 120 ringgit. Um, we are most likely wondering why I'm installing the, um, the sensor at the rear view. All right. so. Most of the time, I would I believe I would be cycling indoor. Um, I I have purchased a train a bike trainer for that, and yeah, it's much safer for me. Cause I don't really cycle in a group. I normally cycle alone. All right, and it has been more than ten years since uh, I last cycled. All right, so <laughs> uh, I need to build up my stamina before I go out into the. Wow, 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 alright. Okay, the reason why I choose this is because it stated clearly that this uh, wireless unit actually supports rear wheel. Some of the cheaper ones, those that's below 50 ringgit, I asked the sellers, they are not confident in telling me whether it can be installed on the rear wheel. It has to be installed on the front wheel. So if I'm using a bike trainer, having it on the front wheel is totally useless. Okay, um, how long does it take to install this? Probably one or two minutes. It's actually very simple. Alright, just a band here and a band at the bottom. Yeah, that's it. That's it. So if you like this content and you would like to see more about cycling stuff or more DIY stuff, make sure you hit the subscribe, the like, and make sure you comment. Alright? Till next time, I will see you again.